everyone, myself Vidyash I am studying in 10th standard in Morarji Desai Residential School, Gudenali, Thurvegere. Today we are going to know about acids, bases and salts. Acids. Acids are solutions in which they are sore in taste and they changes the color of blue litmus to red litmus. Similarly, bases. Bases are also a solutions in which they are bitter in taste and they changes the color of red litmus to blue litmus. Here we use the word litmus. Litmus is an indicator. Then what is indicator? Indicator tells us whether a substance is acidic or basic by changing the color. Indicator is not only litmus. Indicator has so many forms such as turmeric, methyl orange, phenylophthalene and etc. But we use the litmus as main indicator. Litmus has the pH value. The pH value is 0 to 14. Here 0 to 6.9 is considered as acidic and 7.1 to 14 is considered as basic. 7 is considered as neutral. Some of the acids are very harmful when they are in concentrated. When it comes to diluted, they are lesser harmful than concentrated. If they falls on our hand, paper or any surface, it will burn out. So we have to be very careful while handling the acids. Some of the acids which we use in our daily life, they are not harmful, such as vinegar. Vinegar contains acetic acid and lemon. Lemon contains citric acid and tamarind. Tamarind contains tartaric acid and also milk. Milk contains lactic acid. Now, let us do an experiment on indicator by using turmeric. Let us now let us take a turmeric powder and add two three drops of water and make a turmeric paste and spread it over the sheet and add some citric acid and vinegar. Now the changes of color show that whether it is acid or base. It is turning to red. This confirms the solution is a basic solution. When we use the turmeric as an indicator, if it turns to red, it concludes that it is a basic solution. So this is the end of the experiment. Let's come to salt. Salt has the pH value of 7. It means neutral. As we know that common salt that's obtained, we use it as raw material for various materials such as bleaching powder, baking soda and washing soda. Bleaching powder CaOCl2 calcium oxychloride is called as bleaching powder. Bleaching powder is used for bleaching cotton and linen in textile industries and bleaching wood pulp in paper industry and bleaching cloths in laundry and it is used as oxidizing agent in many chemical industries and then baking soda NaCO3 Sodium hydrogen carbonate or sodium bicarbonate is called as baking soda. Baking soda is used as ingredient in antacids. It, ex it neutralizes the excess acid produced in our stomach. How we provide relief to us? As we all know that neutralization reaction, that is acid and bases react to, react to produce a salt. When we take antacid to our body, it reacts with the excess acid produced in our stomach and provide produce salt and water. Like this, they provide relief to us. And then washing soda. Na2CO3 into 10H2O. It means sodium carbonate and 10 molecules of water is called as washing soda. Washing soda is used in soap, paper and glass industries. And it is used as cleaning agent for domestic purpose. So these are some of the information of acid, bases and salt. You all for watching this video and thank you principal sir for giving me this opportunity. Thank you.